<sighs> Damn it, we almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. Lee, maybe there's another tape. We gotta keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out in the alley by the auto shop. Yeah. Maybe you should search it, see what he's got on him. Righto, let's go back to the alleyway. What could possibly go wrong? Okay, yeah, for a second I was like, where's all the dead bodies? Yeah, when do we open this? I don't remember. Alright, let's go back. Whee! And we gotta go back. Like, how are we gonna get there with all the walkers? And I don't know. They all seem to be inside, but... Where are you going, Lee? It's not where I'm... These controls. Okay. Wah! Ah, fuck! <laughs> Get off me! Well, that was disgusting. The shelf's gonna break someday. Really? You just jump off? And you get back here, you little shit. Oh, okay, now- when did it close? Like, what the shit? When did that happen? Take that! Yeah, he seemed like an old dude. Why didn't they keep Vernon as a doctor? This might be just what we need. And what's this? Looks like some kind of code. Oh, Vernon yes. said the safe combination was only four numbers. Yes, but we shall go in into the Shit. locker. Time to go. Oh, gl uh, I was going to say, good, he does it all by himself, because I don't know how I would have got back. I think that's the point. Like, how, how the shit do you get back? Oh, that does not sound good. This must have been his locker. Yeah, let's uh, open this shit. Another tape. Safe combination has got to be on one of these. Oh, you'd hope so. I found two more tapes. One of them is dated October 10th. That's the day after the first one we watched. Put it in. Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically you do. You can terminate the pregnancy or leave Crawford. Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. Maybe that's best. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive, to keep on living? This is what it takes. If this is what it's turned us into. I don't make the rules, Anna. Doctor, I'm begging you. Please help me. Maybe one day when things are different, you can try again. But for now, today, we have to do this. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, sh that's... Yeah, yeah, they didn't get sick. No. No. Yeah, that's... Yeah, because she shot at people. That looked stupid. Yeah. I don't think we know what happened to Crawford. More importantly, we got the combination. Krista, are you alright? 
What's wrong? She's sensitive. Not... That was just hard to watch. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. All right. Let's get those meds and get the hell out of here. She's all hormonal. We're in business. She did throw up earlier because she gets nauseous easily. Morphine. Take as much of this as we can carry. Okay, I think we're good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. You know, Wait. I found a third tape in the locker outside. Maybe there's something else on there. We got the meds for Omid. That's all I care about. We'll head back to the classroom. Don't take too long, Lee. Oh, I didn't know there was a third one. <laughs> all right, let's watch it. All right, last one. Oh, yeah. Listen, as fun as this was, I have to put a stop to this little arrangement. This is the last I can give you. Why? Overson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. He's really cracking down. I just can't risk it. We had a deal. Yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. My sister needs this medicine. Without it, she'll die or she'll start showing symptoms and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah, that's the Crawford way, isn't it? Ew. But yeah, so I'm pretty sure, like, her sister got killed or something. Well, shit. Yeah, let's GTFO! What are you doing? The controls are being a bit jacked. Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh, you scared the shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. I'll take that battery now. Oh, yeah. Uh, about that. I'm just kidding. <laughs> you asshole. <laughs> Get out! Here you go. What's that? Nothing. It's her sister. You can quit with the act, Molly. I know you're from Crawford. What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. Why'd you lie to me? I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You saved my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth? Are we really gonna do this now? I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was 14 years old. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place or in their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic, and by Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. I kept it a secret kept her safe for as long as I could, but in the end, I couldn't protect her. That's when I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked, how anything was better than becoming one of them, but I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late, before they came and took my sister away. This is all I have left of her. I didn't have time to take it before I got out of Crawford. Yeah, I man. just wanted it, okay? It's okay, Molly. I understand. She's pretty. What the hell? <laughs> She's pretty. Get the hell out of here. No, no. Yeah, you know, you know what he means. But it was just like, <laughs> okay, let's get out of here. Oh, <laughs> sorry, sorry. I just got spooked by those bells. Oh, he took out. He what took the fuck out are the you thing. Doing out here? Kenny and I still can't get the door open to the armory. 
He sent me out to look for something we can use to bust it open. I found this. Oh, you uh, idiot. Kids? Where did you get that? I just found it. It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway. Are you fucking there. kidding me? Oh, no. oh, shit! I love how, like, they all conveniently come out at the same time. Yeah, just do that, man. She's got this. I did it. It yeah. wasn't me! I'm going, kid. Nice shot. Um, you patoot. You were super helpful. Yeah, why not just like start slashing them on? like that? They're coming. Let's go. Pew, pew. Oh, shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. You fucking on, idiot. <laughs> Fuck's sakes. This is my fault, all my fault. The yes, hell is he babbling it about? is. Yeah, we talked about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean, this is all your fault? Penny, I'm so sorry. I'm no, so no. sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, save it for later. I opened the door. I let them in. Ben, we don't have time for this now. I'm sorry, Lee. I can't do this anymore. He's got a right to know. Know what? He's got the worst He's timing. Been me all along, putting all of us in danger. Katja and Duck, it was all me. It was all me. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the motor inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck. <laughs> Yes, this is not the time. Do it later. Murder him. Who cares? I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. Gotta focus on getting out of here. You little pisshead! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dead! My wife and child! You gotta both fucking kill! Kenny, listen to me. You can whip his skinny little ass later. But right now, we gotta go! Nice group you got here. Not the time, Molly. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! You hear me, shitbird? You can stay behind and fucking rot! Kenny, we'll sort this out later. Yeah, after not now. We get out of here, okay? Ain't nothing to sort out. I just told you the way it's gonna be. The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's gotta get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here! Well, I vote we leave him. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well. But all I want to do is get back to Omid, and you put that at risk. Yeah, but he's a fucking Wait, idiot. don't I get a vote? Yes, she does, because she's a valuable member of our team. Of course you do. And it's nice. He's my friend. We don't leave friends behind. That's my vote. Oh, she's dogs. On second thought, I think I'm gonna abstain. Lee? I fucking abstain, we can't then. do this right now. I abstain. We'll figure this out later. Yeah, now is not the time. What Shit about sake. the rest of us? Don't we get a second? <laughs> ah! No. Well. Oh my gosh. Now can we go? That's disturbing. Vernon, right. come on. You know, I I would have shot her and then then run off. It's my head cannon that she she got shot. Righto. So much for the armory. What's left of it? A few rounds. That's it. Oh well. You didn't close that door behind us. I could. The lock was busted. Great. Just fucking great. Come on. There's got to be a way out down here. Oh. Well. Nope. Ah! Nope. 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 No. It's not gonna hold. Back upstairs. Lee, look. Yeah, I would have shot Bray and then ran out, cause you know I don't want her walking around. But that's uh, that's shitty. That sucks, man. GTFO! Oh, 
GTFO! No, thank you! Ah, fuck. Uh oh. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> nope. Alright, get, get my leg out. Get my leg out. Get my leg out. Alright, get my leg out. Get my leg out! Yeah, yeah, okay, I did it. <laughs> I was like, how much ammo do I have? Oh, shit. Thank you! That's super helpful. GTFO! Get out of here! Hi! Howdy! Yo, what, how, what, what's cracking? Oh, that's gross. I want that. Aw, oh, damn it, we lost it. We lost the hatchet. You little patoot! It's alright, I'm fine. Wait, where did she get that gun from? Any way out of here? <laughs> this leads to the roof. We might be able to find a way down from there. You did didn't I give come it to into her? town from the railroad, did you? Yeah. Why? Never mind. I can see the sewer where we came in from here. Wait. I think we can do this. Well, what are we waiting for? Go, go! You might want to hurry up. Come on, let's go! Dude, don't be a little dickhole. Hurry up. Ew, that's... Oh, it's a dude. It's the leader. Yeah, I'm not an asshole. I ain't gonna drop you, man. Climb up. Come on, you can do it! There's no time! You have to go! Now! Don't, don't do this! Come on! Let go, damn it! Get Clem and the others out of here! Lee! It doesn't matter what decision you make, Lee, but um... We both know. Nah! Let me go! Yeah, man, I was not gonna <laughs> let you die. Go, go, go. Even though you're a dickhole. I'm not, so. This was. Krista? Yeah, Everything this was okay? not how it was gonna go down. He's fine. Hold on. Is he dead? Krista, don't! Stay back! I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Krista, get away from him. <clears throat> yeah, he's fine. <laughs> Hey, back already? Oh, we got you medicine. Good. Feel like I could use some. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. You okay, kid? You look worse than I do. We almost didn't make it out of there because of this asshole. Should have left him behind when we had the chance. Guys, what the hell happened out there? Let someone else tell you. I got work to do. Yeah, Kenny, I wasn't gonna be okay. an asshole. With a little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes, thank you so much. Oh. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk in private. Too cute. Listen. About what happened to Bree. Don't beat yourself up over it. It was nothing you could have done. You oh. want to know the worst part? It's pretty understanding. What? I don't feel much. I mean, I don't feel enough. Shouldn't I be broken up over what happened to her? That's how I was when I lost my daughter. 
when I lost my friends in those first few weeks. But now, it's like I just take something like this in stride. Like this is what our world is now, and we'd better just get used to it. What did you want to talk to me about? I know you care about Clementine. Anyone can see that. And I know you want what's best for her. But this plan of yours, putting everyone on a boat with no destination, do you really think that's her best chance of finding somewhere where she can be safe? Because I don't. So I want to make you an offer. What kind of an offer? Stay. I'll take her off your hands, take her back with me, to my people. We're well supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us have had kids of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer than she will be if she stays with you. I oh. promise you. That's what you Why want can't for her, I stay it? with be her? Safe? You're coming at me with a lot here, Vernon. I need to think it over. Of course, take your time. But I want you to think about some things. But, yeah, I like to You're think it. You're a good it. man, Lee. You've been protecting these people as best you can so far, and they look up to you, rightly so. But it's different with a child. You might have brought her this far, but sooner or later she might ask you for more than you can give her. I'm sorry if that's hard to hear, but it's the truth. I appreciate it, Vernon. Let me think about it, okay? You do that. Yeah, I like to think it from Lee's point of view. Like, of course he doesn't want to leave Clem, but they've stayed alive for so long. And he's right, they're well hidden, they have a sewer system. No. But I think I'm gonna ask Clem about it, because it, you know, it should be her decision, hey, even though she's nine. Going somewhere? Yeah, I'm about to head out. I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything. It's been fun. You don't want to stay? What are you talking about? Kenny's working on the boat right now. Thought you were coming with us. God knows you earned it. Yeah, I've been thinking it over. It's not for me. It sounds like it'd be pretty crowded, and I never did like the water. You sure about this? Yeah, I think Kenny freaked her out of sure. shit. I've always done better on my own, anyhow. Listen. I'm not much for goodbyes. Tell the others for me? Sure. You take care of yourself, Molly. You too, Lee. Aww. Aww. Yeah, to be honest, I wouldn't want to stay with us either. <laughs> you be sure to take care of that little girl. You know she thinks the world of you. Aww. Too cute. Good luck. Ain't nothing to do with luck. Sweet pea. Kenny's working on the boat. I know. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? <sighs> I don't know. Someplace else. Someplace better. Clem, honey, what's wrong? Is Ben going to be okay? He doesn't seem the same since he got back. Ben's a good kid. I think he's just feeling guilty about some of the decisions he's made. He's getting a feeling like he's a burden on the rest of us. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? Um, I don't know. I'd like to, Clem, but I don't think we'll have time. We really shouldn't stay here any longer. It's not safe. <laughs> I wasn't gonna lie to her. God. Please. I want. Hmm. I hate being honest. <laughs> oh, you little pachoot, please. That's not a good idea. But regardless. Oh, I thought he was just going to leave the room with the radio there. I'm like, that's not a good idea. <laughs> 
Oh, I couldn't. Yeah, she. Well, I fell asleep, so. Clementine. <sighs> but oh, I couldn't have left her there. I mean, I like I couldn't have like sat there and listened Clementine. to her cry. <laughs> I would not be able to sleep. Yeah, she's gone out to find her parents. It doesn't matter. Even if you say yes, like, she still runs off. But I... My thing is, like, with Lee and Clem, I always, like, I want Lee to be 100% honest with her. Like, all the time. Because... Where is everyone? I guess everyone's, like, sleeping. Maybe. I don't know. Clementine! Clementine! But yeah, I always wanted it that, like, Lee was always honest with Clem. God. Like, no matter what. It's the second time you've lost your bloody hat. Don't do that. Please. This is like literally the worst thing. No, don't pick it up, man. Don't pick it up. I kind of remember when stuff happened. Fuck! Yeah. Yeah, dude. Lop that arm off. No. 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 Fuck. Lop it off. Lee? Lee? You out here? Oh, I'd I'd Lee? lop it off right now. Cause you have to do it like straight away. If you're lucky enough to get bit on an like on an area you that you crazy? can cut what off. What are you doing out here? It ain't yeah, safe. I'm not. I'm not gonna Lee? lie. Where's Clementine? She's not in her room. Vernon ain't in the house either. What the hell is going on? Cause Who's I have a right to know. Mark. Oh my god. No way. No. Oh. No fucking way. There's no time to worry about me. Clementine's gone. There's no chance she just wandered off on her own? No. No way. Then who the hell took her? I don't know. That asshole on the radio. Offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust him. He didn't do it. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Okay. What do you need from us? Need to find her. Clint may not have much time. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? We're all responsible for Clementine. And in your condition, you may not make it to her in time. She needs our help. All of our help. Damn right. We can't let you do this alone. Aw, they're so, so awesome. We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. What are we waiting for? <laughs> Thanks, guys. I appreciate it. Yeah, okay, now I'm, like, remembering the end and all the feels. Lee, man, you know I care about Clementine, and I am a Christian man. But I keep asking myself, if this was me asking you for help, asking you to put your life on the line, would you be there for me? Because there have been plenty of times when you ain't been. Dude, come on. I'm dying. She's family now. She's all I got. Hell. In the end, family's all that matters. And you were there for Katya and Duck when it mattered most, I guess. Yep. All right. I'm in. What he gave me the same doing? response. Now hold on a damn minute. My I'm not going if this little shitbird is too. Lee, you want to bring Clementine back alive, you'll leave him behind. He fucks up everything he touches. Deal with it, Kenny. The way I see it, Ben still has a chance to make things right. If he wants it. How about it, Ben? I don't know. Whatever you think is best. Clementine's one of the few good things left in this world. She stood up for you and Crawford when Kenny wanted you gone. 
Don't you think you owe it to her to stand up for her now? You're right. I owe her. I want to do this for Clem, but I want to do it for Kenny, too. I gotta make it right with him. Somehow, I gotta make it right. Okay, guys, we should go find Vernon, see if he took her. Let's head out. What about the boat? We just gonna leave it unguarded? If someone was gonna take it, they'd have done it already. Besides, what choice do we have? Yeah, just like close the shed, don't like leave it wide open. Man, my group's like the best. Aww. Yeah, because I wasn't gonna hide the bite. I don't know what happens if you do. I think they still help you out anyway. But it's like, you know, I'm bit, man. Yeah, they cleared out. Because I don't see anything. Yeah, where did they go? Like, I don't, don't know. Where the hell are they? Looks like they got out of here in a hurry. Vernon, get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. We should have lopped off that arm. <sighs> yeah, what's going on? Where are they migrating to? Close this door. Clementine, are, are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch. Vernon. Um. Who is this? It's not Vernon, if that's what you're thinking. Then you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. <laughs> You're fucking dead! <laughs> and then it ends. I think, I think mainly because it's like, uh, um... Like, with the first season, your choices don't really have, like, any weight whatsoever, so I'm kind of like, oh, it doesn't matter if I tell him to go fuck himself or anything, so. Did you kill the boy in the attic? Most people did, because, you know, you can't just leave him there. Did you lie to or threaten Vernon? Most people were rational and honest. Uh, did you bring Clementine with you to Crawford? Yes, because what's the worst could, that could happen? Um... And she's a cutie patoot, and she's, like, super helpful, so... Did you let Ben fall to his death? You and 66 players pulled him up. Yeah. Because it's like, oh, I'm not going to be... I'm not going to be that asshole. Like, come on. I'm... Uh, like, you get pissy at him for doing all this, like, shit and being a dick. But, like, you know... You're just as bad if you're doing the same shit, so... And did you reveal your bite to the group? And most people did. Because a lot of people had, like, a sense of loyalty. Okay. So, uh, oh, okay. I didn't, I didn't think I saw this when I first did it. Yeah, so you have, like, a certain group. I don't think it makes much of a difference based on, like, who you bring. But I was just like, oh, let's bring everyone. But you can go it alone, go with Kenny... I'm like, nah, let's bring the whole gang, man. Let's bring everyone to... Oh. Yeah. Ah, <sighs> so...
So, that's episode four. What's the time? It's almost five. Yeah, that was episode four. So... All this shit will be resolved in the next episode. And... I am looking forward to completing the series. I am super stoked to be completing the series. And um, then I'll do 400 days afterwards and then it'll be all done. Like, Walking Dead will be completely done until the third season comes out, which I'm super excited about. And, um... Uh, yeah. I'm just gonna take my headphones off because it's a bit, bit warm today as well. Um... Yeah, uh... Oh wow, look how many like zombie voices there were. But yeah, all of this stuff gets resolved in the next one. Um, I took everyone with me. I I know who dies, I'm pretty sure most people watching will um will know. Uh, because it is an old game and people probably know what's going on already. Uh, especially if you watched like season two, you probably know who was already in the group and who wasn't and blah blah blah. But, uh, yeah, I can't wait till this is finished. I am super excited to finish it. And, I, yeah, I'm just going to, like, end the episode here. Or at the end of this credits. I'm going to stop talking soon. But, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know in the comments down below what you think. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed. Um, don't feel pressured, though. Um, like buttons for people who enjoyed. If you're like, Ugh, then don't like it. But, uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed, and uh, hope to see you guys in the next video of whatever I make. So, good day, good night, farewell.